Hello everyone, I'm Ron Trevino. And I'm Rekha Mutaraj. Congresswoman Sheila Jackson Lee says she wants to be the next mayor of Houston. She joins a crowded field of candidates, including State Senator John Whitmire and former Harris County Clerk Chris Hollins. Gerald Harris is live downtown with a reaction to this major development in the race. Gerald. Yeah, Congresswoman Sheila Jackson Lee has spent 28 years in Washington, D.C. Now she wants to come home to the Bayou City to lead it. Sheila Jackson Lee wants to come home to be your mayor for the city of Houston. During church service at City Cathedral Church, Representative Sheila Jackson Lee, a Democrat, revealed her aspirations to be Houston's next mayor. Welcome to Politics Done Right. It's an announcement that has ignited a buzz from talk radio on KPFT 90.1 FM to the internet in Houston's communities. It's heating up and it seems like Sheila Jackson Lee has joined the fold. The announcement thrusts Jackson Lee to a top contender spot. Congresswoman Sheila Jackson Lee getting into the race definitely changes the dynamic, not just financially, but for the electorate. Mayor Sylvester Turner is term limited, making this a race for an open seat. In many ways, it makes perfect sense to me. Um, she started her career off in, in, um, in city government and many of the issues she wants to push uh, affordable housing, criminal justice, bail bond reform, issues dealing with affordable housing. These are not issues that are easily worked on in Washington. KHOU 11 political expert Bob Stein says an aging Jackson Lee is likely reconsidering her future with the possibility of a more conservative Democrat in John Whitmire becoming the next mayor of Houston. I think they represent maybe not the wide chasm that exists between maybe the Trumpers and the non-Trumpers in the Republican Party, but it is a difference of substance. And Senator John Whitmire had no comment on today's news development. Mark your calendars. Election day is November 7th in downtown Houston. Gerald Harris, KHOU 11 News. Oh, yeah, the race heating up. Gerald Harris, thank you.